What if your body is not just a body? What if the very atoms inside you mirror the solar systems above? What if your brain looks almost identical to the universe itself? Across science, philosophy, and spirituality, one shocking idea keeps returning, humans may be living fractals of the cosmos. You are not separate from the universe. You are the universe, experiencing itself through the form of a human. Part 1. The Atom and the Solar System Let's begin in the smallest world we can imagine, the atom. Inside every atom, electrons orbit a nucleus of protons and neutrons. Their motion is governed by invisible forces of electromagnetism. Now compare this to our solar system. Planets orbit the sun, held together by gravity. The patterns are so eerily similar that early scientists described atoms as many solar systems. But here's the shocking truth, both the atom and the solar system are mostly empty space. If the nucleus of an atom were the size of a marble, the nearest electron would be hundreds of meters away. The rest would be emptiness. And yet, this emptiness is not nothing. In quantum physics, empty space is alive with potential, virtual particles flashing in and out of existence, energy fields vibrating invisibly. The same is true of the cosmos. Look at the night sky, vast darkness dotted with tiny sparks of stars. The universe itself is mostly empty space, filled with dark matter and dark energy we cannot even see. This means that the very structure of the atom, the building block of your body, mirrors the structure of the cosmos itself. You are made of emptiness, filled with hidden energy, just like the universe. Part 2. The Brain and the Universe Now let's move from the microscopic to the macroscopic. Take a close look at the human brain. Inside it, billions of neurons branch out, connecting through synapses, creating an intricate network that allows you to think, feel, and be aware. Now compare this to the large-scale structure of the universe. Astronomers mapping billions of galaxies discovered something astonishing. Galaxies are not randomly scattered. They form filaments, webs, and nodes, almost identical to the pattern of neurons in your brain. On one side, a photograph of the brain. On the other, a map of galaxies. Place them side by side, and you would struggle to tell them apart. Both the brain and the cosmos are networks of nodes connected by filaments. Both carry flows of energy and information. This similarity leads to a profound question. Is the universe itself like a giant brain? And are we its thoughts, 